Hi, I'm Jadine Hudson and welcome to the NRMA's driver's seat. Did you ever think you'd see the day when a car could see by itself at night, break itself, detect when you're falling asleep, or even find its own car spot? Well, that day has already arrived and the new S-Class can do all that and so much more. There are just so many gadgets in the S500L that we simply couldn't fit them into a three minute video. So instead, we've decided to go through a few of the highlights. Take Night View Assist Plus for example. All you have to do is push this button and up comes a camera image of the road ahead. The system uses an infrared camera located at the front of the car to monitor the road ahead. Another cool safety system is called PreSafe. What the car does is it can actually recognise the road ahead and it can recognise if you're going to have a crash. So, the system then tightens the seat belts, it can close the sunroof, closes the windows and basically prepares the cabin and the occupants for this imminent crash. So, if the driver fails to react to the imminent collision, fails to press the brake pedal, the car will automatically brake itself. Blind Spot Assist can actually detect if there's a car in your blind spot. It's a radar based system that light will actually flash red and you'll get an audible signal to remind you that there's still a car in that blind spot. So we've already covered some of the key highlights, but look, there is so much stuff in this car. No more needing to fill around underneath. You can just flick the button up and you can put it down. Really cool stuff. Then you can actually go into this screen which has a whole heap of different navigation tabs, your telephone, so it connects directly with your telephone by Bluetooth, so you don't have to take your eyes off the road. Then you can actually go further into this and if you scroll across it's got a vehicle setting. You can adjust the lumbar settings. Then open that up, there's your six disc CD player and you've got all your regular functions. And a pretty cool thing I actually like is that they've stayed with that more sort of old style thing and you've actually got a normal analog clock there rather than the digital. So to create extra space down here, Mercedes has actually moved a lot of stuff that you'd see in a conventional car and they've put it up here within reach. Uh, so you've got a gear, the gear shift lever is up here on a stalk. All your controls for all the dash and instruments are here on the steering wheel. You've got paddles, so you can actually go up and down gears. And look, there's no handbrake. That's because it's actually located over here. It's now electronic. There's headlights that follow the steering path, automatically dimming high beams, adaptive cruise control, a television, soft touch closing doors, an automatic tailgate, and loads more. As this car is a limousine, most of the people who buy it will be sitting right here in the back seat. You can actually move the rear seat if you want to have, say, a bit of a sleep, if you're a bit tired. So it actually folds down, push the button, and down it comes. You can also control the one at the rear. Then, of course, if you're here working, you need power outlets to be actually able to power up the laptop. Then you fold this down. You've got cup holders. And to make sure you look good at the end of the day, when you jump out of your beautiful limousine, you have your own little vanity mirror, which is lit. The S-Class is the flagship of the Benz range and is worth a cool $310,000. This is the S500L. The L stands for long wheelbase. So how does it drive? Well, the S500L is big and it weighs in at more than two tonnes, but it's surprisingly agile. Not that most people who buy this car will drive it anyway. The 285 kilowatt V8 engine has some serious grunt. The seven speed gearbox is silky smooth and despite its size, the S500L uses a respectable average of 10.9 litres per 100 kilometres. It may be out of reach for many of us, but these models are the test beds for the latest and greatest in technology, which will one day flow down to more affordable models. So, while it might cost the same as a small unit, without cars like this S500L, the advances in technology that we will one day take for granted would simply never come about. If you'd like more information, head to www.mynrma.com.au forward slash motoring.